Hello kids from YouTube, here is Mephistopheles and today I bring you an NUUU match with Hey dude 69 69 69 69 69 Yeah okay So he leads off with an Esprit, I lead off with my um, Rampardo's Heat Rex And that was a, a very low trick He tricked me my choice scarf Yeah he tricked choice scarf over and over I went for the crunch hoping to kill cause you know base power and yeah, and uh, powerful attack. Now he switches into Drapion, and uh, the crunch didn't do to Drapion any sh any shit. So I switch into my Wet Monkey, my uh, uh, Ambi Pump. He sets up the Toxic Spikes, which is really annoying, but anyway, I have an Edo King in this team, so I can uh, successfully reset the Toxic Spikes. I go for the Fake Out, and now I see that it is the uh, defensive one, Drapion, so I hate them very much. I go for the double hit to see how much it would do, but it, it didn't do anything, so that makes me really sad. He goes for a crunch, and I know this thing is EV then defense and uh, HP, so it won't do a whole lot to me. And now he switches, and switches into Miss Mages to absorb the double hit, and he does it very pretty nicely, uh, but now I go for the Thunder Punch to get as much damage as I can, predicting him to go for the sub, but he goes straight for Hidden Power Fighting, so my Wet Monkey goes down, which is really bad for me, but anyway, Miss Mages is, I don't know, my Miss Mages is pretty cool. So now I go into my Purple King, my Nido King, uh, to reset up the spikes, the Toxic Spikes, and now he switches into his Masquerade as I went for the Choice Bandit Thunder Punch. <laughs> and I kill off his Sprite, which is really awesome for me. And here comes out his Drapion, and I have to switch because I can't do nothing to him. I switch into my Red Hat, and he goes for a Crunch. I was fearing the Earthquake, and so I played Risky. He gets the Defense Drop, which is, yeah, whatever. And... Now I'll go for the Stone Edge because I know he has Miss Mages left in case he wants to switch into Miss Mages, but I miss! And now he goes for a crunch and I leave with 8 hit points. I get another defense drop which is um, useless. Now I hit the Stone Edge and actually I think the Stone Edge missed the first time. Really costed me the game. And now he, he's able to kill me off with a crunch. And if I hit uh, that Stone Edge I would be able to kill it off. Yeah, okay. So now I go into my Purple King, go for the uh, safe Thunder Punch. The choice when the Thunder Punch would be enough to kill off this, um, um, this Drapion. And now comes his Umbreon, and I was like, oh my god, I have nothing to counter this thing when my, uh, Scarf Ramparos died. He goes for a Curse, and I was hoping for a Parahex. I know this thing has synchronized, but anyway. So, but now I decide to switch into Miss Mage, so I don't know for what. Uh, he goes for a curse. I know this thing is uh, special bulky, but he is becoming to set up there his curse, so it, it beca becomes really annoying. So I go for the hidden power fighting now. I don't want to set up something, or I don't know. So and now he goes for a payback, and payback uh, after a plus two payback, it's obviously going to kill off my mages, which makes me really sad. I believe because you know this mages is a pretty strong Pokemon. So now I go into my Nita King, go for the stab, uh, choice bandit, dark way, on a plus two defense Umbreon, and that did like nothing. And he goes for a payback, and payback, uh, does quite a nice chunk, but he gets the kids the poison point, which really helped me in the long run, you will see. Uh, so yeah, the, the poison point is a really cool ability. So I go for an earthquake, hoping to get as much damage as I can on this. And I bring him to red, which is really awesome because uh, the poison is going to weather him down a little bit. Um, so the Sunbrand looks pretty, uh, pretty weak at this point, so yeah, I can go into my camera and go for the flamethrower and finally kill it off. Uh, but my camera is a special ball and D and HP and it doesn't have any, um, any defense IDs, yeah, EVs, and any um, special attack EVs, so the Feraligator goes, uh, goes out and shows me off with the, the four times speed uh, Now I don't mind if you store my dance bars, which is a toxic strong defense 
to the wall. And that's what you have to take out because that max HP, max defense. I go for the toxic, it's kind of a toxic off of him. And uh, now, uh, she goes for a sword stance, and I kind of, um, I don't know, predicted that. So I went for the body slap to get as much damage now as I can and to wither him down slowly. And now I predict him to attack. So I protect. Uh, and yeah, he goes for an aqua jet. And that, of course, is not going to hit me. And I know that uh, he's going to die after the next life for uh, poison damage. So I stay and I went for Roost to get uh, as much health back as I can. Because I know I can hit the plus two aqua jet. So I go for the Roost. I get almost my all, all of my health back after the left And uh, the Feraligator goes down. That uh, shows that uh, Dunsparks is really cool and can handle even a Feraligator. I mean, if there were a battle where uh, uh, Dunsparks killed and killed to that Gyarados. Now he goes in his Venom off and he's been used to Toxic so I have nothing left uh, except the Body Slam to, to, to hit him. So, I get the paralysis of the, the body slap of the venom off. And now I'm going to be annoying and to roost to, or to hoping for a parahex and maybe for a life for, to kill him. But anyway, God of Us does a little bit more than uh, the roost uh, heals. So, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, actually, I just I hope for a parahex. But I know I can't win because he has a mistake just left him. I will attack him with his body slam. And he can uh, easily absorb the toxic with, uh, with a substitute. So it's pretty much good game at this point. But I think um, this such miss uh, really costed me the game. But anyway, that was a really cool uh, and you 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 can match. Hey, dude, 69, 69, 69, 69, 69, 69, 69. Uh, yeah, so please check him out, he's an awesome guy, and sub to him, sub to me, and really good game, see you guys later, right, comment, subscribe, bye!